yoga for the brain yoga for the brain that's what I'm doing right now I'm doing a session of neuro optimal neurofeedback and so I'm listening to very relaxing music and the music is though stopping uh, for a split second whenever my brain goes off track when it goes out of pattern or when it shows instability in its pattern and so the computer monitors my brain waves and it looks for changes in those patterns and when it detects one it stops the music for a split second so that my brain can get the information of that and it can learn to write itself and learn to correct itself and learn to function more efficiently and effectively because of that information now my brain still has free will the computer is not doing any control of my brain it's just giving my brain information it's kind of like driving on the interstate if you're not paying attention you get off in the bumper strips on the right they're rattling and making noise but if you intend to stay in your lane you just steer back into your lane because the bumper strips gave you information if you intend to pull off the side of the road you can still pull off the side of the road you'll get the bumper strips on the way too because they're giving your information that you're out of your lane so the brain has free will but it can use that information to function better and to function more efficiently. So I'm just listening to relaxing music. There's some uh, pretty pictures on the screen that are correlating with that. And my brain is getting more information about how it can function better. And so one of the best things I ever did for my brain was this neurooptimal neurofeedback. Because I used to have a lot of memory issues and a lot of losing things and spending up to an hour a week finding them and that was a big deal for me because my mom had passed away with Alzheimer's and I thought you know I'm headed that direction I'm headed that direction I got to do something and neurooptimal neurofeedback is really what turned it around so again there's sensors here on my ears and on my scalp and the uh, brain waves are being read, the computer's analyzing those instantaneously within milliseconds and giving my brain feedback on what it's doing so that my brain can function more efficiently and effectively. We also have another type of neurofeedback called quantum neurofeedback and that relies on a quantitative EEG which measures brain wave activity patterns and plots out a bunch of numbers for us on the brain wave patterns so we can see the slow waves to the fast waves and where things are out of balance and I call that more heavy lifting for the brain because that really helps the brain get out of a rut and get into better patterns so each each type of neurofeedback just like different types of chiropractic techniques works differently for different people and so that's why we have a variety of tools so that we can always help our patients get the very best and so if you're suffering from depression, anxiety, feel like your brain is slowing down, and we can measure that with the EEG, you may want to use one of these tools, these neurofeedback tools, so that you can be healthier and happier and have br better brain health as you age. So I'm going to sit back. I'm going to enjoy my session here in a second. That it's, uh, it's actually going on while I'm talking with you, but I've just got the music turned down low. And I'm going to turn this off in a moment. I'm going to finish chilling out and enjoying my session of Yoga for the Brain. I'm Dr. Michael Winters, Winters Wellness, Chiropractic Redefined. Like us on Facebook and subscribe to us on YouTube.